He's but the baby, oh. Oh, Lord, have his mercy. Hey, I say. I'm feeling all this, she already know this. She want a bad man to come and video this. I'm feeling all this, she already know this. She want a bad man to come and video this. You are murder me. Hey, 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 hey. You are murder me. Hey, hey, hey. Guys, so I'm going in my market palette. I'm gonna take this creamish eyeshadow and I'm gonna blend that below my brows. Yeah. Then I'm going back in my market palette. I'm gonna take this brown eyeshadow and I'm gonna use that as my transition color. I'm going my Nubian palette, I'm going to take this Morocco eyeshadow and I'm going to put that in my crease area. Then I'm going back in my Marfa 350 palette, I'm going to take this brown eyeshadow and put it in the crease area also. And then guys you want to blend 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 because blending is always the key. A blending can do a lot different so just blend all them eyeshadows out. And I'm going to take my concealer, my LA Girl concealer to cut the crease and guys you want to take your time doing this. This video is fast forward so it looks like I'm doing it fast. I'm really slow guys like really really slow. Give them, give them, give them, give them, girl. So make you show them, show them, show them that you got it. The way that you wind that booty on me, you make me wanna sign that booty for me. I'll do you anywhere when you tell me on. You're looking at me, girl, me say carry on. Say, girl. I really like the way that you carry your body, say, girl. Then after finishing cutting the crease, I'm going back in the Morphe palette to take this dark brown eyeshadow just to give back that cut crease some definition. I'm going back in the Morphe 350 palette and I'll take this white eyeshadow and put that on my crease area, area where I cut the crease. And I'm just doing this just to prime my eyes for the eyeshadow that I want to use. Oh Lord of His mercy, she a murder me, she did murder me. Then I'm going back in my Nubian palette. I'm gonna take this shimmerish silver eyeshadow and put that over my eyelids. And guys, you could use whatever you have. You don't have to be the same palette that I use. You could use a color close to it, or you could just do what you like, honey. You could do whatever you like. I'm feeling all this, she already knows. She wanna bad man to come and be the I'm feeling all this, she already knows. After that, now I'm just gonna take my NYX eyeliner. I'm just gonna do a wing liner. And guys, you wanna take your time when doing this. It looks like I'm doing something fast, but I'm really slow. Like, I'm the slowest person in the world. Then I'm going to take my Ulse of Lashes Lash in Iconic and I'm just going to put on them bad boys on. Yup. Then after that, I'm just going to prime my face using my Elf Primer and this step is very important. Like, you need to do this. Like, you got to do this. Then I'm just going to color correct my face. If you don't have like spots or so in your face, you could skip this step. But I definitely have like spots because my face is like breaking out. So yeah. Then 
then I'm going to use my Maybelline Fit Me Foundation in 355. I absolutely love this foundation. It's my new favorite. So, yeah. And then I'm just using a foundation brush. And I'm just dabbing on that foundation. You don't want to swipe it. You don't want to go around and around. It's better to dab it. Then I'm going to use my LA Girl Concealer in Toffee. Normally, I will use Fawn, but I was out of Fawn. So, I'm going in with Toffee. And I'm just putting that under my eyes, my nose, above my lips. You know, all of that. On my forehead, because I don't have any forehead. You can stand by me anywhere all day. Then we're using my Real Techniques blending sponge just to blend that out in a patting motion. Then after that, I'm just going to set my face using the Sasha Buttercup setting powder. Then I'm just going to contour my face using my NYX contour palette and I'm using the two darkest color. And I'm just contouring my face just to get, bring back some definition that the foundation took away and also to slim that face down. And I'm also contouring my nose. And after that, I'm just gonna dust away the um the Sasha Buttercup using um a powder brush. Then I'm just going in my Smashbox face powder and just to put that where I did not put any product after my foundation. And I'm using this blush, this nude blush. And I'm going in with this ColourPop Glow and I'm just put that where I want to glow. Then I go back in the Morphe palette and I go under my eyes. I'm the guy you never heard of. So and I go in my inner corner with the same color that I use on my eyelid. Then I'm going to use this Curly Pop Liner in K. I think that's the name. And I'm going to take this Kapow lipstick from Curly Pop also and put that on my lips. This and then I'm gonna set my face with the L setting spray and this is the finished look guys and if you guys enjoy this video please remember to subscribe and like and comment and share. Thank you. Bye babies. Mwah.